Hi, I'm Miss Hearn. Let's get started. We are going to use a Venn diagram that we constructed in the previous video in order to answer questions about a survey. Six. So now we answer the questions. A. Find the number of cities that has either soccer or rugby, but not both. Soccer or rugby, but not both. Soccer is the S circle. Rugby is the R circle. We're going to include everything that's in soccer or rugby, but not both. So I'm going to include all the places that have soccer together with all the places that have rugby, but I'm going to avoid the places that have both soccer and rugby. So the number of places that have, so the, well, let me put it this way. Um, we're looking at regions four, uh, three, four, five, and seven. The places that have soccer or rugby, but not both. Regions one and two have both soccer and rugby because they're in the intersection or overlap of the two. So we're going to add up 13 plus three plus five plus 15. That's gonna be 36. 36 equals 13 plus 3 plus 5 plus 15. Oops, I did that too fast. All right, find the number of these cities that has fewer than two sports. Okay, so any city that's in any overlap of any of the sets is going to have at least two sports. The cities that have only one sport would be the cities that have, let's see, in region five, region six, and region seven. And then there's also cities that have none, which is re uh, region eight has six. So we need to add up 13, 14, 15, and six, which is gonna come out to be 48 cities that have both. Okay, next we're going to find the number of cities that have rugby, but neither basketball nor soccer. All right, so to have rugby, but neither basketball nor soccer means it's in the rugby circle, but it's not in, it's not even touching the soccer or the basketball circle. So that only is region seven, which has 15. Find the number of cities that does not have exactly two sports. Not exactly two would be either zero, one, or three, right? Not exactly two. All right, so we know that the region out here, region eight, that has none. We know that region seven, six, and five all have one sport. Region three, or sorry, region one, which has three cities in it, that has three sports. Regions two, three, and four have exactly two sports, so we're not going to look in those. So we just have to add up 13, 3, 14, 15, and 6. So 51. All right, so the basic idea for solving a problem like this is to draw your Venn diagram label the cardinalities starting with any of the facts that give you information about exactly one region and working your way out through the facts to add more regions in there. You're always going to have to be subtracting from these values that you're given whatever ones you've already written on the uh, Venn diagram. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please remember to like it. That'll help other students to find the video.